The overall goal of the following experiment is to determine startle-induced and long-term spontaneous locomotion in a rotenone-induced Parkinson's disease model of Drosophila. This is achieved by rearing Drosophila on rotenone-supplemented food to induce the phenotype. As a second step, flies are subjected to the startle response assay in a double vial apparatus and long-term spontaneous locomotion assay in a Drosophila activity monitor. The results show that exposure to rotenone causes locomotion defects in Drosophila based on quantification of startle and long-term spontaneous locomotion. These methods can help to answer key questions in the field of Drosophila models of neurodegenerative and locomotion disorders, such as defects in startle-induced locomotion and long-term spontaneous locomotion. To begin, add 1.5 grams of instant Drosophila medium in a standard fly vial. Constitute the medium with 5 milliliters of deionized water containing the appropriate rotenone dose. Next, sedate 8 to 12 male flies aged 1 to 3 days old using carbon dioxide and transport them to vials containing the drug supplemented food. Allow flies to recover from sedation for 20 minutes with the vial in a horizontal position. Then place the vial upright in a 12-hour light-dark incubator at 25 degrees.